the Crane Room for your lunch and dinner rendezvous. You'll enjoy their pleasant atmosphere. The Crane Room takes pride in their wide variety menu. Appetizers, sandwiches, soups, salads, entrees, pasta, and the best burgers in town. Newcastle's best selection of domestic, import, and craft beers from around the world. And the Crane Room features a 35-tap draft system. Ask about their daily specials that will please you every time. The Crane Room is located at 3009 Wilmington Road in Neshanic Township. Call 724-656-1553. Joshua Sun Rehabilitation Center. From the moment you arrive, you know that you're in the right place. Dr. John Wrightson listens first. He pays attention to detail and then makes the determination. Joshua Sun Rehabilitation. We make the pain go away. Good morning. Welcome to Wednesday, March 11th. Hopefully you've got that first cup of coffee. And wow, what an array of information we have for you today. Straight ahead from Newcastle, PA. And we're going to get to that right after these messages. Everyone goes to Pizza Joe's, and you've heard that friendly slogan for many years, and it's just as true today as it was when you first heard it. Watch the game right here on NCTV 45, and then head over to Pizza Joe's. Pizza Joe's uh, provided a grant for this podcast, and they have many great locations, State Street, Highland Avenue, Croton, and Shenango. It's your local pizza place. Everyone goes to Pizza Joe's. We have a great relationship with Main Street Clothiers and Custom Tailors in downtown Newcastle at 210 East Washington Street. And whenever you watch Focus NC, my wardrobe is furnished by Main Street Clothiers and Custom Tailors. Magisterial District Judge Melissa A. Amoni announces her candidacy for the Judge of the Court of Common Pleas for the 53rd District a lifelong resident of Lawrence County with 15 years of judicial experience, Judge Amodi is the only candidate with judicial experience running for this position. Because of her experience, Judge Amodi has a unique understanding of the issues and concerns of families, schools, and businesses throughout our county. Judge Amodi is a proud graduate of Newcastle High School. She attended the University of Pittsburgh, graduating cum laude, and obtained her law degree from Duquesne University School of Law. She passed the bar in the Pennsylvania and New Jersey. Judge Amodi respectfully asks for your vote for Judge of Court of Common Pleas in the May 15th primary election. She hopes to be a candidate on the Republican and Democratic ticket. The only judge running for judge, paid for by the committee to elect a Modi for judge. It's winter, so come on inside, sit down, grab a cup of hot cocoa, and watch NCTV 45.
Welcome to Wednesday, March 11th. You've made it over the hump. Hopefully, you've got that first cup of coffee. And on this middle of the week, we're going to get to the top stories today in Newcastle, PA. Well, after 38 years, it was time for Ducky to Pissionary to pass over his cleaning business. He passed it over to good friend Louis DiCaprio. Ducky had been doing this for 38 years, as his friends affectionately call him. Now he can buy my son more donuts and coffee. Uh, we want to congratulate him on his retirement, wish him the best. And uh, tell Louie, one of our advertisers, way to go, now advertise more. <laughs> so congratulations to uh, Ducky Pissionary on that new move. Now, I had told you the last few days about uh, the Cascade Warner Theater downtown. Now, keep in mind that the restaurant's getting ready to open. You know, we're, we're weeks away from that. Not weeks, like months. No, we're weeks, like just a few weeks here. And the Warner Theater Group, the Cascade Warner Theater Group, announced their Facebook page. So I went to check it out. Something you definitely have to do. Very impressive, okay, had a lot of information out there. Thanks to Jerry Kern for making that available. And I suggest that anybody um, doing the Facebook thing, go there, check it out. I'm sure you're in, you'll enjoy it. Now, don't forget tonight at the Lawrence County Historical Society, they're having that They Also Served program. Now, it's about the women who served in World War II. And that's going to start at 7 o'clock at the Cavelli History Center, 408 North Jefferson Street. Ruth Fairchild will be the guest speaker. She joined the Army in 1982, serving 12 years as an operating room technician in Alabama, Texas, New Jersey, Germany, and Saudi Arabia. Upon returning to Newcastle, Fairchild joined the VFW, where she became involved in many positions, um, post district and state levels, serving Pennsylvania's first as first female commander. Fairchild is currently serving as supervisor at Jameson Hospital, and she spends her spare time volunteering with the VFW and helping veterans. So great program, you should check that out. Now we talked about New Visions and they, a um, couple different things here. Number one, I wanna remind you that uh, their due, nominations are due by the 10th for the Clean and Green Action Team. Okay, Great Places is sinking nominations for great neighborhoods, great public places, and we've got plenty of both. You know, it's time that if everybody cleans up their little corner of not the big world, but Newcastle, then Newcastle's going to look a lot better, and that makes a difference, a big difference. So if you see somebody who has a great clean and green space in Lawrence County, send it in to Mary Burris with the Clean and Green Action Team with a nomination by the 10th. I'm sure that she'd love to hear from you. Enough of those nominations. There's a, a, a distinction that they're giving. Now, also, 
from New Visions. Um, just the communication team. Some things that were uh, talked about and uh, gone over is Stand Up for Newcastle is looking to be more out in the community downtown. Uh, you'll see them this summer through different areas and functions in the city. Uh, we want to thank them for putting this together and sending those minutes through and talking about the uh, the Riverwalk concerts and the various activities that go on downtown. Now a lot of people wonder, well, how do I get involved with New Visions? It's really quite simple. Uh, on North Jefferson Street is their office right next to the Capitol Grill. If that isn't enough, you feel free to send an email to nctv45 at gmail.com. We'll forward it to Larry Corvey. And keep in mind that the first of each month, you can stop by the Confluence, and I'm sure they have meeting schedules available for you. So that being said, we're going to take a break, get a few messages from these great sponsors, and come back with sports. See you in a GIF. The Beanery Depot and Deli. Coffee, made to order subs, snacks, and more. Meatball sandwiches, fresh and hot. Pepperoni rolls, fish sandwiches, chicken, milkshakes. The Beanery Deli. When you're hungry for something special, and it won't cost you a lot of beans. Let's talk with Norm. We're with Norm Lutton. Norm, you're the owner of Crazy Car Restoration. Why don't you tell us a little bit about that? Well, it's a new company we're opening up. Uh, originally, we was Lutton Auto Repair, and uh, we're adding on a little bit. And we're trying to bring out some uh, custom cars for people uh, somewhere in uh, between the five and twenty thousand dollar range, uh, what people can actually afford today. Uh, Any more, you know, all these cars are so expensive. We're just trying to make ends meet for other people. That sounds great. Now, uh, but I've been fixing cars for over thirty-five years. That's great. So when you have a repair, big or small, call Norm. Welcome back. And now it's time to take a look at sports. Well, first off, we want to give a heartfelt congratulations to Newcastle's Amateur Wrestling Club. Uh, there was a tournament up in Sharon, and the club took uh, first place. Great job by that amateur wrestling club. Would like to thank them for sending in the information. Congratulations again. And great job, guys. We appreciate it. Tonight on the hardwood, down at the A.J. Palumbo Center, the St. Louis Billikens will take on the Duquesne Dukes. That will be a 9 o'clock start. So look to our blog for results. Also last night, the Newcastle Red Hurricane took on Indiana down at North Allegheny. Check our blog for those results. Elsewhere, we already had told you that the Pens lost in a shootout to the San Jose Sharks, two to one. Well, the Oilers uh, lost to the Red Wings, five two, and the Islanders beat the Maple Leafs, four three. Predators over the Coyotes, two one, and the Ducks <laughs> lost to the Canucks, <laughs> two one. Now. 
In other action, if you were wondering, in the Mid-American Conference, Ball State, we had a request for this from one of our viewers. Ball State took on Bowling Green, and Bowling Green beat them 88-75. to 75. Congratulations to Bowling Green on that victory. Now, we're going to be back with weather right after these messages. They look like you should be able to find them in a lot of the bigger, more expensive department stores. Our scarves, our shrugs, and our Say No More shirts are exclusive to Inspire Tees. We want to give you apparel that is pretty, sexy, flirty, and makes you look like the woman you are meant to be. Hi friends, I'm Gary West, and whether you find Augustine's Pizza at your local grocery store or at their restaurant in Newcastle, the folks at Augustine's Pizza hope that their pizza is always your first choice for any and all occasions. Welcome back, and now it's time to look at weather. Well, folks, yes, we got that rain last night. But at least it wasn't snow. Rain in 35 was the overnight environmental effects of the evening. What will you see today on Wednesday, March 11th? Well, you're going to see plenty of sunshine with a high of 50. And tonight's overnight low will be 29. Now on Thursday it's going to be a sunny 50 degrees with an overnight low of 34. Now we're going to be back with a wrap up right after these messages. the China Banquet in Newcastle for a tempting mouth-watering buffet that you'll enjoy every time. China Banquet is open Sunday through Thursday, 11 a.m. to 9.30 p.m. and Friday and Saturday, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Call for takeout or eat in their pleasant surroundings. China Banquet is located at 102 North Jefferson Street in Newcastle. Call 724-658-7777. That's 724-658-7777. The Globe Leader, your hometown newspaper since 1880. Go to nwglobe.com to read fascinating articles. If you know someone who would enjoy this amazing publication as much as you do, why not give them a gift subscription? I'm excited about getting this into the homes of as many people as possible. Please send their email address and we'll do the rest. Call 724-946-8098. That's the Globe Leader, your hometown newspaper since 1880. It's winter, so come on inside, grab a cup of hot cocoa, and sit down and watch NCTV 45. Happy, Happy birthday, Dad! Well, thanks 
for all those birthday greetings. Yes, today is my birthday, and I appreciate all the emails that I've received wishing me a great day and phone calls also. Thank you again, and uh, by all means, I think I'm going to get that second cup of coffee. And maybe I just might get that third when that birthday cake rolls around. So have a great Wednesday, everybody. We look forward to seeing you tomorrow. I know I'm going to have a great day.